Good morning, good morning. I am back because I get so many comments on sweet, growing sweet potato slips. This is my first year doing it too, guys. But what do you do next? Do you just plant it like this? And I try to respond, but let's go ahead and put a video out there on what to do next. So I've got three of my sweet potatoes, two of them, um, none of the slips are quite big enough yet. Uh, so you want to wait till your slips, I guess, are like four to six inches long. And let's see, I'm going to actually snip this one off here. I'll show you. Um, so here it is. Maybe you guys can see it's going to grow little roots out of these little nubs. And I've got a jar that has kind of like a flower top vase um, lid on it that'll just help hold the slips. And it's just water, and you're gonna put it in here. You know, like, what are those plants? I have a bunch of them in my window that you grow and they just grow roots in water. And you could start them if you wanted to. And um, what I'm doing too is I'll, I'll show you the potato. I'm snipping them off, kind of. I'm gonna go ahead and take this leaf off this bottom piece. I'll show you how much I'm leaving on. And each one of these will be a plant. So that shows you how much I left. And see that little start of a, maybe you guys can see in there, a little start of another slip. And it, they'll keep producing slips right there. So I'm probably gonna have to add some more water to this jar. Okay, so this one, I think I got everything off that I could. I took one here, here, um, and it's just gonna keep going and keep going. And as they get bigger, and then this one, You'll see I took off here and there's probably going to be two or three more slips there. And I took one here and there's going to be another slip there. So we'll put those back in the window and this one. Yeah, see it's already growing um, slips or roots up here off these because they've been down in the water. So we'll go ahead and take this guy. But look how big that stalk is. I'll tell you what, when I order sweet potato slips in the mail, they're not that big. So I'm really excited about what, what I'm gonna get out of this. Get in the hole. And that's gonna be what I do from here on out as they get, you know, like that, I gotta find room. As they get probably four to six inches tall, I'm just gonna um, snip them off, add them to this jar, let them grow roots down. Eventually, I'm probably gonna have to move up to a quart size jar and um, because the roots will get too big. And then you can even, once they start growing long, snip them again out here and put them in to make more, even more slips. So say you didn't get a bunch off your potato, but you can still make more off your vines. So this is just gonna go in a window and uh, we will wait till probably the end of May, uh, 1st of June is when I actually plant these for my last frost day in growing zone. I'm in Southeast Michigan, zone six. Um, my last frost date is April 28th and I um, have to, these are a tropical plant, so you have to wait till the soil's good and warm. So thanks guys for coming along and hopefully this gives you an idea of what to do next. I need to add more water.